Hello, everybody, and welcome back to What's He Doing? What's He Done? It's 48 hours. You've seen it. It's up on the wall. Look, wait for it. Bam, it's up on the wall. So, I'm Carl. I'm sure. You saw this last season. It's back for this season. We've got some more exciting stuff going on. We've got a new list. Sean, we're going to get straight into it. Who's first? Man United versus Fulham. Seeing as there's only the one goal, it's me that gets to go first. And this one's Bassey. He just falls asleep on his man. Absolute statue in the box. Garnacho's ball straight across. And Xerxes, awesome name. Uh, it's a tap in. To, like it's it's a weird looking goal it, from some angles it looks like it's just it's him in the knee but it's actually a really good finish that's what he does Dutch excellence following on from that it's Liverpool versus Ipswich Sean's up our first is Davies mm. not Ben Davies a worse Davies this is just straight up laziness from Ipswich's number three mm -hmm. when your job on the pitch is to mark Salah you've <laughs> got to be prepared to run 100% and he gave up immediately <laughs> he, did, he yeah. was not chasing the man the man was gone we saw this last season as well some people when they think they're going to play an offside trap and Salah's like nah mate I'm too quick for you it was the point where he was ahead of Davies and Davies just didn't run Salah's got that go faster haircut now oh yeah Cucurella take note one of us might have that at the end of the season <laughs> depends where Man City finish go watch that bit up next, Sean, our first double of the season. First game, second game in, and who'd have thunk it? Ipswich, everyone's favourite to win, insert tumbleweed. Uh, yeah, Ipswich, Davies, what are you doing? What are you doing? You can't pass it to Salah after letting him score on you like half an hour beforehand. You've, you've teed it up for him. But the worst person to tee it up for, Tiger Woods, don't tee it up for him, uh, and Mo Salah, he's going to slam it in the back of the net. It was the case of... The ball was fine if he didn't touch it. And then he slowed it down and Salah could get on the end of it. Yep. Misery business. <laughs> Arse wolves. What he said. Arsenal versus Wolves. Me up first. It is. It's me. It's me, Amadio. Another fantastic name. Mosquera. Why you no jump? What's wrong with jumping? Havertz, I know he's six foot two and he's deadly finisher. But if he just jumped, you know, you'd block the ball coming deadly in. Deadly finisher now he's awesome for some silly reason. We're not jealous or anything. One of the Champions League. Yeah, he just stood there and just let Havertz jump over him. Who's next? All right, Sean, next goal. Guess who's stuck in reverse gear? Who? It ain't Nori. Oh, who is. is it? Oh. Yeah, it ain't Nori. Just when you think they'd learn from keeping backing up and then backing up and backing up. Might as well put the beep beeps on this. Vehicle reversing. Ain't Nori. What are you doing? What are you doing? Stay on your man. Hold your line. Don't just keep backing up. You might as well sit in the crowd. Okay, and then the team I have definitely got going down this year, Nottingham Forest versus Bournemouth. Uh, Sean's got the first one. Take it away, boy. Zaba Yani up first. Ah, yeah, yeah, to be fair to him, very unlucky. He just blocks his own team's clearance. Yeah. And it leads to the goal. So, you know, just get out of the way. Get out of the way, Zaba Yani. And then uh, who's next? Funny that. Deja vu. Marillo. What are you doing? What are you done? I'll tell you what you've done. You did what Zaba Yani did. Get your head out of the way of the play. Uh, so it's smashed into his own face, which then led to the goal. So, um, yeah, just, just get out of the way. Dabiani and Murillo making their own little we don't let our teams clear the ball club. But Semenya scored again, so clearly the best Hurry player. Hurry up and sign him, Chelsea. Best player in the league. Yeah, we don't need wingers. <laughs> Brighton versus Everton. Yeah, Brighton, Everton. John's up. Mikalenko. Now, this this minty kid yeah. from Newcastle that's joined Brighton, apparently yeah. he's really good. And I wasn't believing the hype because I don't think there's been a good player to come out of Newcastle since Alan Shearer. Yeah. So, when he's on the ball... And he's running like he weighs 300 pounds. Hmm. But he's rapid. <laughs> and no one's getting near him. How do you run like you're 300 pounds? Like a train oh, runs. Just doesn't you know? stop. Like yeah. Bosh. yeah. Train's about 300 pounds. No? <laughs> no. And then, um, yeah, this, <laughs> this, this kid is mental. Like, Mikalenko, very, like, decent fullback normally. Mm -hmm. Quite strong on the ball. Just gets thrown. Yeah, thrown, bullied. bullied. Out of the way. Yeah. Ball across. Mitoma. Minty to, Mik Minty to Mitoma. Yeah. Hard to say for some. Oh, you're killing everybody here on the vernaculars, man. Minte, what a name. No, you just add him for strength, speed, passion, everything. The lot. Yeah. Okay, so the next one's actually, it's one we see often-ish, but uh, body faint wasn't even needed. Uh, Welbeck, just absolutely twisted up keen. So should be doing a lot better, so certainly from a centre-back, but I mean. Welbeck had him shaking in his boots. Michael Keane was afraid of Danny Welbeck. <laughs> yeah, the guy did just start wobbling. Yeah, he was like, oh no, oh no. Oh, I don't know where to go. He did trip over, which is a little unfortunate, but it does not look funny and silly. Don't trip over. Poor guy, get the right studs on. Oh, what's that? Who's at the door? It's a second double. It's a second double in the first game of the first season. 
And it's Mikalenko again. He is. What's he doing? What's he doing? I'll tell you what he's doing. He's not watching a Dingra, no. which is dangerous, first mm. of all. And then once he is watching a Dingra, he just runs past him. Yeah. Just Mi- lets, no, lets him Mikel free. Mikalenko, me, me, and, me and Sean don't do what's he doing like this. We're watching you. You've got one eye on the cake shop. Like, one eye on you need to keep an eye on a Dingra, because my guy made you look silly. A lot of the one goal games I'm not involved in. No, you're not. <laughs> Uh, that means it's Newcastle Southampton time, and it's only fitting that I get to do Newcastle because I'm a secret Newcastle fan. Now, um, it's not a secret. When you tell everyone, it's not a secret. Yeah, it's not a secret. Um, firstly, Fabian Cher, what are you doing? Stop here, mate, people. That's not part of this video, but come on, don't be stupid. Um, looks like I've got a new goalkeeper to bully, Alex McCarthy. What are you doing? What have you done? Last I checked, Sean, I'm yeah. still your bit. Isak. Yeah. Does not play for Southampton. No, you'd be correct. Yeah, no. So why on earth would McCarthy think, oh, all these yellow shirts to pass to, I'm a park to that geezer, I'm a pass to that geezer in the black and white stripe. What a sausage. Especially that one. And then, like, yeah, no. The best one. <laughs> <laughs> there's one. He's got three people. So, he's gone down the middle. There's one here. You can't <laughs> see my hand. There's one here and there's one about here. I got and, you, boy. And there you go. So there's one here yeah. and there's one here. Isak's where the microphone is. Yeah. And he's passed to the microphone. Yeah. Why part? Don't pass the microphone. Run the ads. <laughs> oh lord! Run the ads. <laughs> you can't do that. <laughs> Run the ads. <laughs> That's a howler. That, that is an That's L. A howler. A long. Yeah. Well, a big to, L. Might have to redo that one. <laughs> it was an yeah. accident. That is funny shit. Okay, West Ham, Aston Villa. Sean, this is yours. Now this man, uh, I did not know his his style before mm-hmm. he came to the Premier League. It's an Argentinian. Mm-hmm. By the name of Guido Rodriguez, and he's awful. <laughs> <laughs> Truly, you had when, going there for a minute. West Ham have a thing where they're trying to replace Declan Rice with mm. South American holding midfielders. Edson Alvarez, mm-hmm. tragic. Yeah, tra- awful. Guido Rodriguez, one game, one fault. Mm. Not looking too good. Great replacement for Alvarez, though. Oh yeah, better than Alvarez. <laughs> he's straight on it. But um, debut goal for Onana. Mm. Fair play to the guy. That's Big that's up. a holding midfielder right yeah. there. Big up on the on the corner. But, uh, taker. Rodriguez followed Onana the whole way in. Obviously, Antonio's marking the mm. six foot seven yeah. midfielder. And then Rodriguez is in front of him where he should be. Doesn't mm-hmm. jump. Doesn't jump. No. Why not jump? Too in? distracted by the man he's covering. Why, why, why jump? In? But you at least got to jump anyway. If he does jump, he probably does dink this over because I think Onana has ducked down to head of this because he's so big. He's it, jumped like nine feet in the air. When someone in front of you jumps, it gives you a decision to make in your head. Yeah. Whether or not, oh, he's probably going to get the it's ball. It's not even so a decision. I'm if someone not... jumps, jump. Yeah, but <laughs> no, when Onana, before Onana can jump, if he jumped, mm. Onana's then thinking, oh, I'm probably not going to need to yeah. jump for this because he's going to clear it. He won't, certainly won't be able to see it. You just have to give people like a thought mm. to process. Yeah, you've got to make them stutter. Make them question. Make them pause. An easy one for you. I've got an easy start. one. One of the three commandments, those who were here last season, you'll know the commandments. What are they, Sean? We don't give it to the keeper unless it's Absolutely 100% the keeper. Yep. McCarthy. <laughs> if you score an own goal, it's your fault. Don't be doing that. Yep. And if you give the pen... You, you get g- the fault. Matty Cash, what are you doing? We you done? Can't, can't give a pen away there, boss. Soft. The soft pen. Don't do it. Don't whisper into the mic. ASMR. It's uh, not even going to pick up. People will be doing weird stuff to the vid. <laughs> Cur. That's why he's, Sean's cut all his hair now. That's all that's for all of you lot. Constantinopolis, Mavropanos. Constantinopolis, Mavropanos. There we go. Lovely. That's yeah. going to be our theme tune. Let's get a 48 hour theme tune. That's not even his name. name. <laughs> but, um, Guy's got all the syllables. What do you mean it's not his name? It's like, it's not Constantinopolis, is it? It's Constantinos. But, yeah. But I've added Anopolis. Oh, that's that? more running out. To make it fit into a song. <laughs> I could call him Constantinople. Right, Sean, talk to me about this drag back pass. Yeah, I mean, Mavropanos just overruns pass. Yeah. I mean, he what summoned his are Michelenko. you doing? We done. The ball can only go one place. Because if, if it's not passed backwards, he's running off the pitch with it. Yeah. Has to cut back but or inst- pause it. Instead of him running off the pitch, he passed it in and Mavropanos ran off the pitch. <laughs> That's not how defending works. It isn't. He's just running past going, oh, okay. Yeah, mate. But he's on the list again. <laughs> I've got to type his whole name out into a database. Exactly. Crystal Palace versus Brentford. Uh, slightly more eventful game. This had draw written all over it, but... Alice just didn't have the minerals, and According Brentford just add it back, add it back. Uh, I'm up first here. Gahey, what are you doing? What are you done? 70 million quid for this. I don't think so. Okay, we've got another example of centre-backs who have clearly been told to bring it back. 
bring it back, drop it back, back it up, like whatever version of it it is. But Gehi, you're better than this. You rocked it at the Euros. We loved watching you play. And now, straight back to Palace play. You can't do that. Keep your quality, keep your standard. Like Sean said, you've lost your price tag. Now, don't just back it up, back it up, back it up, and let Wissa and Mbwemo bully you. Can't do it. Sean's got an easy one, though, because that second commandment's looking real good right now. It is. You score an own goal. You get the oh. ball. Why are you doing that? Who did it, Sean? Pinnock. Oh, let's make it easy. Pinnock, what are you doing? What are you done? He's done. We don't need to dwell on that. You guys not, can see it. That's not your goal, mate. Don't hey? put it in there. Doesn't hmm. need to touch the ball. Exactly. I mean, we don't. Eduard probably scores if he doesn't touch the ball, but like, don't kick it in your own net. At do least so let him score. Do something. Take it He's off in my fantasy myself. team. Yeah, still in everyone's fantasy things. Uh, the last one, I get to do this one. Sean just didn't have the minerals to give Joaquin Anderson his uh, <laughs> his first fault of the season in his first game. Sean, uh, I'll let you tell him the, the good people what he did, though. It's your goal. Yeah, okay, fine. You don't want to do it. That's fine. I understand. There's an order to I this. I understand. And it's it will be followed. There. I understand it's painful. The you. order will be followed. It will be. Uh, jumps too early. Uh, he got a little bit excited. Cross comes in low. Had he have waited half a second, quarter of a second, he would have got his beautiful Prince Charming locks square onto this ball, sending it skyward. Um, very lucky for the keeper not to get it, but it is what it is. Henderson. This close, man. Does. But you that know, flappy bird of a <laughs> goalkeeper save. One that should have been up in the air, not down to the ground, but instinct is instinct in those moments. One of those three commandments saved you. Indeed. From the list. Okay, Depression FC, Chelsea versus Man City. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, yeah, we can't. We've got to cover that. <laughs> no. Not the I'll best game. Pride. Yeah, not the best game for us starting out. Although, glimmers of hope. Glimmers of hope. There's only one person at fault for both goals. Who is it, Sean? Just replace him and we'll be fine. The final double. Levi Colwell. Yeah, he's, he's, he's needs, he needs some adjustment time coming back. Now, I've realised the issue with this list is that it picks up on little mistakes that people make sometimes. Mm -hmm. And he made two and we conceded two goals for them. Yeah. So it makes it look like we're just picking on him. It wasn't the worst defender on the pitch. That was Gusto. Mm. But, you know, that's the game. What was the first one? So Colwell commits to the ball before it's even played. Mm -hmm. And then he goes to the what might happen pass instead of the pass that actually happens. He runs onto the ball where he thinks it's going to be rather than where Bernardo Silva flicks it onto. Yeah, he gets he gets twisted up, doesn't he? Bernardo Silva's got too much quality for that. And then Cucurella just gets bodied by Haaland. But... Sanchez comes and bodies them all as well. Sanchez makes himself as small as possible. So, like Henderson, very lucky. Come on with one second. You just hate Sanchez, bruv. I'm not a big fan anymore. You loved him at Brighton. Loved him at Brighton. Hate him at Chelsea. Uh, second one. Yeah, it's Colwell again. It's the third example this week alone of people just backing up, backing up, backing up. Just running away from their attackers, trying not to get munched, and then getting munched. The irony is thick with these defenders at the moment. I think Colwell just needs time to readjust to the pace of the Premier League because he was out for a little while last year. Well, I mean, really good defenders are doing it as well. So mm. I guess it's just in their blood. Something's happening. Give give Kovacic space to run to the edge of the box when he's 30 yards out, when you could tackle him 25 yards out. Yeah, you've got to, you've got to do something. Come on, boys. Let's Spurs. Yeah, the last one of this uh, match week one. And uh, two goals to sink our teeth into. Sean, you're up first. Spurs doing Spurs again. Mm -hmm. Don't care if we lose as long as Spurs don't win. Mm -hmm. It's it's vengeful, spiteful. Deckled over Reed up first. Yep, debutante. He's committed the cardinal sin of letting your man get in front of you. Yeah. When the cross is coming in. It's forgotten how to defend. And James, James Madison, former Leicester player, mm -hmm. also former Norwich player, puts this lovely ball in. Yeah. And you'd be thinking, Deckard over Reed would be looking at that ball like, oh, I'm normally an attacker. I know exactly where he's going to put that. Yeah. And then as he's looking at the ball, Pedro Porro runs in front of him. <laughs> and headers it into the <laughs> it straight in. Yeah, Tottenham <laughs> doing Tottenham things. Um, yeah, so Tottenham doing Tottenham things and giving the, uh, giving the game straight to their opponent with what is a hilariously Tottenham mistake from Christian Romero. What are you doing? What have you done? Jamie Vardy is in the Premier League 100 club. And as you have probably seen, he's left yards on his own on the six yard line. Let me say that again, Sean, in case you didn't hear me. Jamie Vardy I heard you. is mother. Jamie Vardy is here. Mm -hmm. Romero is here. He runs past him and he's just got cross comes in, dink in. Like acres of space. Honestly, he could have built a house on that six yard line before Romero realized the mistake he had made. 
And that wraps it up for this week's What's He Doing? What's He Done? Match Week 1, Premier League 24-25. Get your predictions in. Get on the prediction video. Like this video if you like this video. If you didn't like this video, put in the comment why you didn't like this video. We want to know how to get better. We want to know what you want to see. We're providing real value here. We're providing real results, real facts. The Premier League just does not tell you. And Sean puts a lot of time and effort into making sure all these facts are indeed facts. And I put a lot of effort into making sure he gets in front of the camera and uh, tells you all. So... There we are. You stole my line. And for some bizarre reason, Ben Foster wanted to steal our thing, our shtick. So. And next time you do that, Ben, I'll be at your front door. So <laughs> don't do it again. Send us your address. <laughs> don't do it. I'll find your address. Don't yeah, do it so, again. What's he doing? What's he doing? Stealing our shit. If you like the video, like the video. Peace.